Hello everyone, I welcome you to the Breaking Science channel. Once upon a time, in a far-off land of test tubes and microscopes, a brilliant biologist named Shinny Yamanaka discovered a magical potion made of special proteins. These proteins, known as the Yamanaka factors, had the power to turn adult cells into versatile stem cells, and for this discovery, Shinya was awarded a very prestigious prize, a Nobel Prize. Years passed and the Yamanaka factors were used in many experiments, but no one had ever tried to use them to turn back the clock for entire organisms. Until now, two teams of scientists, one from a biotech company and another from Harvard Medical School, decided to put the Yamanaka factors to the ultimate test by using them to reverse the signs of aging in mice. The biotech company, called Rejuvenate Bio, used a special delivery system called gene therapy to give the Yamanaka factors to old mice. To their surprise, the mice not only lived longer but also regained some of the patterns of DNA methylation that are typical of younger animals. The mice lived 18 weeks on average, compared to 9 weeks for the control group. The scientists were very excited but also very careful, as they knew that some studies have suggested that the Yamanaka factors can promote cancer. However, they found no obvious negative effects in the mice given the gene therapy. The second team, led by Harvard Medical School geneticist David Sinclair, decided to test a theory that he had been working on for years, the information theory of aging. According to this theory, our bodies get old because of the cumulative loss of epigenetic marks, which are chemical modifications on DNA and proteins that help regulate gene activity. Sinclair's team genetically engineered a mouse strain that, when given a particular drug, makes an enzyme that cuts their DNA at 20 sites in the genome, which are then faithfully repaired. As a result, the mice ended up with an epigenetic signature more like that of older animals, and their health deteriorated. They lost hair and pigment, and showed multiple signs of frailty and tissue aging. But Sinclair and his team were not ready to give up just yet. They decided to see if the epigenetic degradation was reversible, and injected some of these elderly-seeming mice with the same AAVs carrying OSK genes used by Rejuvenate Bio. To their amazement, the mica's muscles, kidneys, and retinas showed some signs of reversal of the epigenetic changes induced by the DNA breaks. Sinclair and his team were thrilled, as this supported their theory that it may be possible to drive an animal's age forwards and backwards at will. Of course, as with any scientific discovery, more research needs to be done before we can say for sure if these findings can be applied to humans. But the fact that the Yamanaka factors have shown promise in reversing the signs of aging in mice is certainly something worth getting excited about. Who knows, maybe one day we'll all be able to enjoy the fountain of youth in the form of a magical potion. Thank you very much for watching. Support the channel with a like and share the news with your friends. That's all the news, see you soon.